Hey guys, so this is a tutorial on how to do a scorpion, and first you want to make sure that your back and your legs are stretched out, so if you don't have your splits or your back isn't very flexible, you can watch my back flexibility video and my splits tutorial. So let's just get started. So first you want to do a leg hold on both sides to see what side is more balanced. And my better side is my left, so I can balance like this longer than I can on the other side. So the first thing you want to do is just grab your foot like this, and you can grab it further down if you want your scorpion to be straighter. But for beginners, grab your foot. And then you can just lift your knee a little bit and then twist this arm. Now if you can't do that, it's okay. Just practice. And you can even put this hand on a shelf or something to balance you. Once you're up there, you can add your other arm on top of your arm like this. Or you can grab your foot with both hands, which make, will make it easier to straighten your scorpion. And it does look better. But if you can't do that, you can just add your hand to your arm. And also you want to make sure that your hips are facing the side, not the front. And also you want to look up in your scorpion because if you look forward or down, you'll want to fall forward and you won't be as on top of your leg. And you can also straighten your scorpion. And to do that, you just go into your scorpion like normal and then grab your foot and crawl down your arms and then pull it over your head to straighten it. So you don't want it to be like this where you're like far away from it. You want to pull it up like this. And that takes a lot of flexibility. And another option is to swing your leg forward and then flick it back and catch it. And you can catch it with both um, arms at the same time. Or you can catch it with your same arm as leg first and then add your other arm. And that's what I like to do. So this is what it looks like. So yeah, that's it for my scorpion tutorial. I know it was really short and there wasn't much explaining to do, but the main thing that you have to do is just keep practicing and try to improve your back flexibility and just keep pulling it straighter every time and it will get better. So yeah, I'll see you later.